Greetings, Zero here, and welcome back to the Steel Mall type run of EV Emerald. Last time we got our final gym badge, but before we go to Victory Road, there's a couple other things I want to get first. We're going to start up here with the Trick House, where the Trick Master has some more challenges for me. I think it's behind the window. Nope. Not this one, anyway. Nope. Aha! He's in the China Cabinet. Alright, so... This one is going to be based on, I think it's Winona's gym. Yep. And, uh, there's one other challenge after this, which is, I think, based on Tate and Liza's. Wait. You tell him a little rusty at this. It's actually a little more complicated than, well... Version of Wine Owner's Gym, as you can guess. Do this. And you get a glitter mail. That's not why we're here. Let's take out this guy first. Best shot, here's mine. Double up. So, yeah, I'm not going to go out of my way to battle too many more trainers, because most of my Pokemon are on level for the, ba the battle with Wallace. It's just Hellion that needs to catch up with the rest of the team. Are you really going to waste my time like this? Fuck off. I hate it when the AI just wastes your time like that. They know they're gonna lose, but it doesn't matter. Alright. Now, I think this is just the way out. Yep, that is. That's just the way out. We can ignore that for now. Okay, no, let's just swap you out. Also, yes, for those of you that may have noticed, I did swap out Wingle for Pelipper, because... Well, for some reason, Wingle can't learn Surf. Pelipper can. And if I'm just going around from place to place, I'm only really going to be using Fly, Fly and Surf. So, having only one HM slave on the team at a time is, uh... More ideal. Okay. Look like that. Wait a second. No, that, that's not right. Like this. Cacturna, huh? okay. You know, yeah, we'll just take you out. Paralyze you. That's gonna get a little annoying, I think. That should still be able to two shot you.
And down you go. So here's the password, whatever that is. It's gonna be... Well, we all know what the passwords are always like with this guy. It's a fucking blowhard. Nope. Trick master is my life. He wishes. And that should be the item I was looking for, the magnet. That I'm going to give to Magneton. So anyways, we can walk out this way. And leave the way we came in. And now we're back here because there's one other puzzle we can do. For another pretty useful item. Yep, he's behind the window this time. Alright, so now we can go through. And this one is based on the gym puzzle in Tate and Lives' gym. We're going to see a lot of double battles this time around. Okay, if you believe in that kind of thing. And so, you know, we're not just going to be doing the trick house stuff, because there is something else I want to get from Meteor Falls. We'll go take care of that later. Level up. <clears throat> okay, so the basically it's the Tate and Liza battle all over again. Okay. I probably should have doubled up on Soul Rock. Oh well. Never mind! Does Magnemite seriously have higher special attack than Registeel? Bear in mind, I gave Registeel 10 Calcians to give it a massive head start when I was training it and getting it levels. I'll have to check that after this. Let's see. Is it? Huh. Or 19? No, but they're... Wait, am I... Did I see that right? Yeah, they're very, very close. Within two points of each other. Not bad. So yeah, we need to rotate this a couple of times to get that out of the way. That'll let us get to the password later. And this we need to rotate a couple of times. First, let's go through here. Okay, we didn't need to go this way yet, but we'll go back this way later. I will say this, I greatly prefer this version of the seventh puzzle to the one in Ruby and Sapphire. That one is just really, really tedious. Hmm. Okay. That might be the first time in this playthrough I got burned by something. Huh. Good thing it's a special attacker, so I don't have to worry about the attack drop.
Although, it would be really convenient if I could use physical attacks on Kadabra. Okay, so, yeah, unfortunately for you, this is Gen 3 Sturdy, not Gen 5 Sturdy. Because Gen 5 Sturdy would give you a free hit. Bye-bye. Okay, so, uh, let's take care of that real quick. Anyways, moving on. You think? Also, by the way, Zatu is utter dog shit in Gen 3. I think in Gen 2 it's slightly better just because the movesets are different. But basically, Natu and Zatu only really learn one. Well, actually, no. It's Gen 2, I think it learns Peck. Gen 3, they change it or something. Where the only damaging move that learns until the 60s is Nightshade. Like, I don't, I don't even really use Zatu on Psychic Monotypes, because it is just that bad. Other than just for flying around. Alright, Tropic Mail. I'll never use these, but there you go. He's... You think? We're fighting in a fucking closet! Chimeco, now there's a rare Pokemon. You only find it at Mount Pyre. At the summit. It's like a 1% encounter rate. Okay, uh, you know what? We're just gonna gang up on you. Oh, that could be a problem. Please knock it out. Thank you! Level up! Nah. There you go. And now we just go back the way we came. Imagine how evil it would be if you had no way to walk out, then you would be soft locked in there. There are ROM hack devs that would do that. And we get the password? What kind of self-aggrandizing bullshit is it gonna be this time? Okay. Trickmaster is huggable. Okay, that's just kind of creepy. Okay, so, uh... And now, we get... A PowerPoint Max, one of only a handful in the game. Anyways, moving on, I will see you at Meteor Falls. While we're on the way, let's go up here. And up here, there is a rare candy. And for those of you wondering, yes, I did decorate the secret base a little bit. That was the whole reason I adjusted this segment of the map, to get the power point up. Anyways, now we can finally go up the waterfall here. And this will take us deeper into Meteor Falls. Actually, you know what? Let's pop a L real quick. 
And we'll head inside. Nope, up in there. Hmm. Can't go up there yet. Oh. Well, shit. Broke dick piece of shit map. Okay, so let's go up here this time. Did they seriously break this part of it, too? <sighs> For fuck's sake, I'll be right back. Okay, it's a quick and dirty fix, but... Hopefully this will get the job done. See, so yeah, I just replaced all those ledges one way with stairs and terraces. I don't know why those are up there. It is what it is. Please tell me you don't know Earthquake. Oh, okay. Okay, so I guess you're gonna get a heal. Okay. Fine by me. There's only a couple of Dragon Tamers in this game. One of them is on one of the routes between Pacific Lodge and Slateport City. And the other one is right here. Actually, there might be one in the 8th maze of the Trick House, I can't remember. Guess Superman here just went up, up, and away. Okay. Now, this should be a... Yeah, this is a double battle. Fifty years! Congratulations! More than half of marriages don't last that long, so... No, I, I'm, I'm serious. Congratulations. Okay, we're gonna take you out first. Uh-huh. I knew it! In fact, Metacham can learn both Protect and Detect. I wonder. Does the chance of them failing stack with each other, or do they not? Which basically means you can stall indefinitely until you run out of power points for both. Fuck off. That's what you get for being a smart ass. Hold up. Yep. You did. Alrighty. Now, let's go down here. Alright, they broke this map too. One more moment, please. Okay, so, yeah, another quick and dirty fix. Now, you may wonder, so, why go through all this effort? One reason, and one reason only. There's up here. And we get ourselves the TM for Dragon Claw. That'll just give me a little something extra to help against, well, Drake. Anyways, that's enough for now. Like what you see, like, comment, subscribe, check out my Rumble page, and I will see you all next time. Oh, just as a quick postscript, while I was trying to splice this together in Bandicut, the software kept crashing, so yeah, looks like I'm gonna have to use different software for that from now on. Uh, 
There were a lot of technical difficulties while recording this. Sorry. Uh, see you all next time.